that's what you get for being drunk after spending some time at a bar with the best with your best with one of your friends hey guys how's it going whether you're a piper such as Angus McCall, Donald McLeod, Mike Cusack, Willie Ross, whoever, or even a Zamponia player such as Gianluca Zamorelli, Maria Varali, um, Gigi Riso, or even an opera singer, Denise Lee, I knew it. She's the best opera singer in the world. Abby Fisher, Laura Breton, Cecilia Bartoli. I got something today that I've wanted literally since 2005. So it was like Thanksgiving of 2005 that I discovered this really amazing electronic bagpipe. It was called the Digger Pipe. I may not have the pronunciation correct, but it was invented by a German electronic engineer. His name was Manfred Deger. D-E-G-E-R. I'm sure any of the opera singers who's, who have sing, who have sung German pieces would be able to help me with the pronunciation of this. Um, according to one, according to one of my voices on a screen reader, so I use a screen reader to help read the screen on my computer, it literally says Deger being D-E-G-E-R and uh, a lot of pipers tend to say dagger which I assume is not the correct pronunciation um, so I'm re relying on that German speaker to help me with the pronunciation of it um Anyway, so I've been wanting one of these things since 2005, and I've been having this really, this recurring dream ever since then about playing one of these instruments. Now, if you guys don't know what electronic bagpipes are, they're pretty simple, really. It's basically a touch-sensitive chanter, so the chanter is the part of the bagpipe that you play with your fingers, and the chanter... It basically, you can allow it allows you to practice the fingering, and you don't need you don't even have to do any squeezing, a bag or blowing with the blowpipe. There's a paper here. I have to just throw that away. Um, you don't need to do any squeezing the bag or blowing of the blowpipe. So it allows you to practice your bagpipe fingering just by doing it, you know, pretty much silently. This won't come out. Um, but it is advantageous for... It is advantageous for learning bagpipe tunes because... It allows you to, you don't have to get out your actual full set of Highland bagpipes and um, get your, learn to play the pipes. You don't have to get out your full set of Highland pipes. And, um, gosh, the thing with this tape and this bubble wrap is just like, oh my gosh. you to practice the bagpipes without having to
allows you to practice the bagpipes without having to get your full set of bagpipes out. And so, you know, you can simply wear headphones and practice your pipes like that using a simple electronic interface like the dagger pipe. Without, without having to, you know, disturb, distract the neighbors. Right, let me see if there's an, there's, let me see if there's an actual battery in here. It feels like there is. Yes, there is. So first, let me make sure that I've got a good um, interface that I could use so that I can record myself playing the dagger pipes. Okay. check and see if there's an actual spare batteries that came with this. No, there are not. Oh my gosh, I sure hope there are spare, I sure hope there are batteries that came with this. Tape marks. Tape marks everywhere. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab some headphones so I can hear what I'm playing. And I'm going to um, I'm going to plug this into recorder, the headphones into the recorder. Oh crap, I lost it. There we go, okay. Alright. Okay, so we're plugged in now. Plug this into the recorder.